who drove a Porsche? I want to make a career for myself, bro. Dick, like, bro. Oh my God, get the f out of here, bro. You're a fucking coward. Yo, chat, I got a question for you guys. Uh, so, Team Fanatic in the World Series Warzone, Almond, Noobs, uh, Skullface, along with other amazing teams, Mutex's team, Tommy's team, uh, just phenomenal, phenomenal teams, uh, Oak and Pick, fantastic Warzone players, all did not qualify in the final qualifier that was hosted today, uh, all due to the fact that there was a cheater in the, uh, in, in the qualifier. And they were like specifically hunting people down. They were like trying to pretend like so many people right now are calling them out on Twitter. So many people like obviously giving their opinion, what they think, like people literally should face criminal charges for this shit and re massive repercussions. And I know for some of you that may sound kind of crazy, but I actually somewhat agree with that stuff because if you really think about it, yeah, this shit is just video games. I know for a lot of people and it's just, you know, you come home, you have a good time, whatever. But for some people, it is their actual livelihood. No joke. Just like hockey is some people's livelihood and other sports, physical sports, games, whatever it may be. These teams missed out on a chance at a million dollars at LAN and not just that, the reputations as well. They can go to LAN and, and, and pop off and have big clips and big moments that can br bring their brand to the next level. All of that cut short because somebody literally decided to cheat in a video game and uh, Yo, they're not going right to face any repercussions. Get the double and then get a fast loady. And they're going to face zero repercussions. I don't know what you guys think about that, but I that's right here, Z. I do want to watch that that clip real quick. Yeah, chat. So a little backstory on this clip. This guy right here, Rob, his teammates with this guy right here, Vexo. These guys, this is the cheater. And his teammate was not aware that he was a cheater. And a lot of people are completely actually agreeing with this guy. Uh, I haven't looked into all the evidence, but like, I feel like if the community, a lot, I have a lot of people that I respect, like, you know, Ebates, a lot of other people in the community that would, you know, obviously would throw this guy under the bus if he actually was uh, not legit, not like uh, legit. But anyway, this is all, anyway, that aside, this is uh, Rob, a clip of Rob talking to his teammate about cheating and just being like, what is your problem? But now I'm finding out that Vex came out to me in a random DM while I'm talking to Ra Ra trying to get a PC check. And he says, you know what, bro? I did that. I'm sorry. So I'll show you guys this conversation and I'll finish out what I have to say. Yeah, I know. Let me get this I straight. did that shit, bro. I know. You yacked up for LCQ and NA finals. I've been yacked up for a while, bro. Get the damage. A while. How long? Uh, since early February, middle of February, around there. You yacked up this entire time. I'm, I'm sorry I put you and your brand in that risk. I know it's my fault. It shouldn't even fucking happen in the first place. I'm wrong for doing it. I'm about to come out on Twitter and admit the shit. Why the fuck would you do that? Why the fuck would you pick me up knowing what would happen? Knowing how much work I put in to get to this point. Letting me do all of that VOD review for us. Making all of those notes. We shouldn't even got caught in the first place. Shut it the was a up. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, you I shouldn't know, have got bro, caught. Bro. You thought you were gonna get. Were well, you gonna go to land and drop fucking three like wag? In six oh, minutes. What the fuck did you think? What the fuck did you think would happen? It was dumb shit that shouldn't happen in the first place. You fucking swore to me. I went to bat for you because you guys took a chance on me. You discredited everything that I did the past six months to get to this point. I'm sorry, man. What do you mean I'm fucking sorry, bro? That means jack shit to me. That means Rob, jack shit, bro. What do you Rob, do with your you? life? What do you do with your that's insane what do you do with your life bro you don't go to school you don't have a job your parents are fucking millionaires they pay for everything bro and you thought you were gonna skate your way to fucking to, to world series land what did you think would happen it, oh that's a fucking sell and we and we still didn't call you were yacked and we still didn't call rob rob okay oh, I call me rob bro i understand right but if you think we're the only team doing that shit bro be that was your real. justification yeah. that was your justification we were, we were I the know, only. I know it's wrong, obviously, right? But I just took the chance. I, I, I know. And literally, it only happened because of dumb shit. DMs got exposed. From our gameplay performance, you couldn't fucking tell. I'm gonna admit it on Twitter. I'm gonna say that you had nothing to do what with it. What the f is that do? Well, what the f is that gonna do for me? What the f is that gonna do for me, buddy? You Clear think, your name. It does Clear your name. shit. It doesn't no matter. Idea. That's like three people they've accused me of cheating and playing with. You okay? Well, and now you, you think actually that, no okay. no. And now you actually did it. You wasted two fucking weeks of my time, and now you actually and you had the nerve to blame Joe Gang on that shit. You guys were yacked, and you still lost, and you blame Joe Gang and want to switch. What did you think would happen?
That makes no sense. What the first thing I fucking told you was don't waste my time. Was that not the first thing I told you? I said if you guys pick me up. What? I know, I know. We didn't cooperate. I know, bro. It's a fuck up, I know. It's not a fuck up, bro. You're just an idiot. I'm in. What the fuck is the point, bro? No, you have to justify it. Explain this to me, bro. Just greed, man. Money. Just greed. You fucking coward, bro. You're, you're rich! Your parents are rich! You drove a Porsche! I want to make a career for myself, bro. Like, bro. Oh my god, get the fuck out of here, bro. You're a fucking coward. Because of this guy cheating and admitting to it on Twitter. Literally bragging about the fact that he could hold his own against the best while cheating. Um, is another level of delusion that is just incredible. Yeah, I don't know, bro. Someone admits to literally stealing, not stealing a million dollars, but stealing the opportunity for many competitors that this is, again, their full-time careers. I understand these are video games, and hockey is a game, football is a game, basketball is a game, but these are all careers for some people, you know what I mean? Same thing with Warzone, same thing with esports as it evolves. For a lot of these people, for Fnatic that just invested in having Skull Face noobs and, uh, and, and Allman represented at the World Series of Warzone, they're now not qualifying because of this guy. Same with other massive Warzone pros that have been playing the game forever that deserve to be in the spots that are so close to qualification, like Tommy and freaking Picnic Basket and, and my boy Oak and like just a bunch of great teams that are not qualifying. Mutex, uh, Rated's team, so many. Uh, because we've got somebody literally blatantly cheating and, and ruining people's experience in the game. I don't know. Again, what do you guys think? Like, some people obviously go to the extreme saying these people should be, <laughs> should face jail time. I mean, obviously, I don't know if jail time uh, and in cheating in video games go hand in hand, but again, some type of repercussion. I don't know. Because it's not just about cheating in a game. It's about, again, stealing the, the opportunity away from these people, stealing an opportunity to win a million dollars. And not just win a million dollars, but also go to these tournaments where they have the opportunity to to win it and win millions of dollars, but also uh, but also get their name out there and build their brand bigger and make even more, like, you know, again, build their business through that and build their brand through that. It's just, in, it's insane. So I just wonder what you guys are thoughts about it because I think there should be some type of repercussion for somebody literally stealing that opportunity away from so many deserving people. Before some of you guys with the comments that are gonna be like, oh, it's just a game, bro. It's not that deep, whatever. I mean, again, like I said before, Major League Baseball is a game. NBA is a game. Hockey is a game. NFL, it's a game. This is also a game. It's esports. It's a form of entertainment, but a lot of money on the line, man. Livelihoods on the line. People that do this for a living, which is, again, they're blessed to do it for a living. I'm blessed to do this for a living, but like, that doesn't change the fact that people like shit stains like this coming in and ruining their opportunities. That's insane, bro. That's ab absolutely insane. Very bad comparison. Why, why would that be a bet? I, and I'm not even like defending my take here, TWD. I'm genuinely curious, like, just curious why the take is bad.